Hey guys, it's I, Game Master Vincent Dallin here again, and today we're going to continue our adventure of Forums RPG, yay! Um, we don't have that much time for an infra, an intro, so we're just going to get right into the nitty and continue our adventure. So last time I defeated Zombio, or kind of defeated Zombio, I mean he kind of just died on his own. And I believe we explored most of the cave realm. I think we will not have to go there again, but I do have some more rounds. I want to check around here. Let's see, it was I think this way. I mean, I believe I already got most of the ores, but I need to explore an area around here. This area. Okay, so this is another area. I'm not going to mine that iron because it's not supposed to be there in the first place. At least, I don't know. I don't think it's supposed to be there. Um, let's see. Oh, look, gold. What's down here? Let me see, and it looks like more gold. Let's see, I know there is a very important weapon somewhere. Um, I mean, not a weapon, I believe it's, um, armor I want to get, or maybe I already got in the last video, maybe? So far, I've already got diamond armor, so that's pretty good. But I want to see if I can get some more, um, items and stuff, and I'm gonna burn. I get cross. You have no water, but fortunately I have that, um, plate that allows me to get over here. And we have more emerald and some more butter because we're going to need some emerald. And I do need about 60. Ow! I do need about 60, um, oh, water. I do need about 60 redstone blocks in order to get that, um, Gannett Protosport level 6. And there is a ton of coal down here. and some iron, which I'm not going to mine because I don't think it's supposed to be there. But, if you guys really want to, you can mine the iron. I'm just not going to mine it because uh, I don't think it's supposed to be there. It's supposed to spawn naturally or something. Okay, so um, we got coal and now I need to find my way out of here. I don't think I actually planned this area for exploration. I think this is just a cave, but if you want to, you can explore it yourselves. Let's check what's down this way. Okay, I think we have been down here. So, I think this way is the path back. Let's get this butter over here. There's some iron right there. I'm not gonna get that. Um, uh, I'm gonna go down there. Oh, wait a minute. There's a dungeon down there with emerald. That is definitely a path I chose to take. I don't know what we're going to use coal for. I mean, usually it's for, um... I put it in mainly in here for, um... as smelting material. And that's going to kill me. I'm just going to take this dirt block out. Because I cannot jump across.
Let me just get this stuff out because I want to get that stuff and I don't feel like it. Again, if it, um, if you find the material and it's too, and it, you, like, drop into an area you can't get it, then it's alright by me if you just dig up the block and get the item. That's a long drop. I got feather falling boots. Yeah, they're falling bee. There's a ton of stuff over here. Okay, so, um, I think I was supposed to parkour across that. I'm gonna have to do that later anyway. Ah, oh, shoot. Dang it. Oh well. Got most of the stuff we came there for. I am lagging for some unknown reason. Okay, so we're gonna check that area out later. Right now, um, I think I spent a little too much time in the um, cave dimension. So I'm going to take my stuff. Let's see now. Um, I have levels, but I don't think I have enough for anything in the XP shop just yet. Let's see now, um, do I want the fish of the true hero? Oh, uh, I don't even have enough to support it yet. Two cool for ten arrows, I have an infinity bow, but, um, let's get some, let's get some because, Um, I want... Where I get this water block from? I have no idea, it must have been a drop from one of the monsters. But we have a water block. Uh, we don't need any of that. Book of the Mikey Hunter. Hmm. Flame V. Um, redstone block and three emeralds. Fish of a true hero will get the fee-ish, which is efficiency and silk touch. That is not something we want to get. It's just a gag thing. The fish of a true hero is actually a gag thing too, but the thing is, it's just awesome. Let's see now, I already have one of those. I need some pants. So, I have enough redstone, and I have redstone block. Now we have pants. I need to deposit some of this junk into my chest right here. So, um, let's see, things we don't need. We don't need these bones, or these, or that potato, or that glowstone dust, or that spider eye, or the book of the pyro knobs either, because I don't plan on using it. But, you can use it if you want to. Let's see, poison, resistance, and speed. We're going to need these. I want the Gannett chip, I don't need this dirt. Nor do I need this netherrack. Nor do I need this string. Nor do I need these two iron ingots. And, um, the sticks. Okay, so I think... Um, I don't need the helm either, because I already have one. Let me see. I need to craft some redstone blocks. Don't mind me, bro. Just crafting redstone blocks. Did you get that sword? I need about 60 of those redstone blocks before I can get that sword. But I believe I only need one emerald. So if I can make redstone blocks. I don't know how on earth I'm going to get 60, but something I want to get. Okay, so far we have not yet enough for anything.
Okay. Now, in this episode, I do want to do something important. Um, I want to complete the side quest. This is indeed nighttime. We can complete it now. It's not a requirement to complete it at nighttime, but, um... It's not a requirement, but I like doing it because it's the legit way I planned it to be. Okay, so we can either take that parkour path over there, or we can go this way. Because I don't want to risk my parkour stuff, and plus there is a, um... Plus there are some pretty cool items you want to get in this area. You should go back here. Okay, so there is a water... Right there. And we jump. We made it. Okay. So down this way... Um, let's see, down this way... This lapis was we don't need to get that. Actually, I think that was the path we're supposed to take. We're supposed to follow the Lapis Lazuli Trail. It's all the way down here. Um, that phone is ringing for some reason. Um... Okay, don't mind that. It's just a phone. <sighs> that was annoying. But we're back on track now. Hey, diamond! I'm mining this. If you find some stuff then that you can craft into weapons and stuff, feel free to do that. Stupid phone. My sister's phone. People left it here. To annoy me. Dumb phone. I'm probably breaking a lot of my rules about breaking these blocks, but who cares? I want this stuff. There is a ton of old stuff, and I'm going to be set when it comes to making um, smelting stuff because I got a ton of iron. We're supposed to follow the lapis of the path. I hear water. Jeez, how much of stuff is here? I'm not putting this much stuff here. Gee whiz, look at all the coal. Never ends. I do not remember putting any of this stuff here. Okay. Well, that was new. I learned things about my map even I didn't know. I didn't, um any of that stuff there. I don't know how this broke. Gold. 
Um, I will be right back. For some bizarre reason. Okay, there we go. There we go. See, I want to get that butter. But this water is really annoying. So we're just going to continue onward with our quest to go up the Lapis Lazuli path. There's some really good stuff we need to get. Because it's pertaining to that... Oops. Oh, shoot. Um, which is pertaining to that side quest I mentioned earlier. And today we're going to finish it. And it is probably already daytime. So I'm just going to set it to nighttime if that is so. Okay, so more lapis. It's still nighttime. That's good. Okay. So, um, we need to go up the staircase here. And once we get up the staircase, we are not done following the lapis path just yet. And I'm lagging. We need to follow the lapis all the way into this cave system thing here or this desert pyramid which I found which spawned automatically so I decided to put it to good use blocked you have to find another way in okay so basically you're supposed to go in here and there should be monsters in here so I'm going to grab my scythe of necromancy Oh no. Back zombie. I have a scythe of necromancy. Okay, I'm just gonna get out of here. Oh shoot. Bad spider. Ugh, that took longer than I thought it would. Do I have Bane of Arthropods in this thing? Um, no I don't. Okay, so we got tons of, um, stuff in here. We got an iron sword. I don't have a sword anymore. So that might just be a good thing. Two emeralds. I am lagging. Why? Two more emeralds. And the sapling of life. That is pertaining to the side quest that we have to get. And there's nothing in there. I already got that chest. Got that chest. And it got the little chests. Okay. So that is pertaining to these side quests we have to do. And there is another freaking spider. Now why does it kill zombies and... Can I have smite on this thing? No. It kills zombies and... Ah, oh, shoot. Okay, I don't... Shoot. I hate these guys. Um, okay. Did I get that bow of the... No, I did not get the bow of the blaze. Okay, so we're going to use some of these arrows. Beat the snot. Add these friggin' spiders. Ah, shoot. I just poisoned myself. Is this seriously gonna kill me? Okay, so it doesn't kill you. And now I'm no longer poisoned. Okay, so that is the potion of the spider hunter. I'm probably going to die right now, so I'm going to switch to game mode 1. And I'm going to get myself a potion of insta-healing. Slash game mode zero. There we go. Oh, that that's just dandy. Well, it pertained to me that that potion the spider um guy was just a bad idea. Give me resistance and speed, but the thing is. Oh, shoot. 
I am gonna die of hunger. Fun is take me now. I already got the potion of I've already got the sapling of life. Okay, so we're just gonna go back. This time I'm gonna take the parkour path because I've actually already got the sapling. That I needed to take the side quest. Shut up, sheep. Okay, so we're going to take that little parkour path over there and hopefully we won't die. And I've already died. I've overjumped that. Game. Ah, oh, shoot. Oh, you know what? I'm just gonna die. Okay, you know what I'm gonna do? I don't have time for this. Would you? What? Ah, oh, shoot. Game mode one. I don't have time for this. And just so you know, you can actually fly all the way over here, but I don't want to do that because it's going to take too long. And we're going to fly. Oh, shoot. I keep over jumping these. There we go. Oh shoot. What might think I'm gonna actually do good? End up sucking horribly. Oh shoot! Dang, I'm usually not this bad. Ah oh, dang it. You know what? This is absolute nonsense. What on earth? A pig! If you let Ignit out, I'm gonna scream. Get off that... Die, pig. Stupid pig. Anyway, okay, so... Over on this direction, if we just go over here... We will find a giant tree. Or a village of some sort. With a giant tree near it. And there should be... There you go, the giant tree. And, um, hmm. I don't remember building it like that. Okay, so, um... So this is where we're going to start our side quest, if we can find the um, chest with the side quest in it. Use this. And no, it's not. I think it's in the big building over here. Here we go. This is the side quest. Okay, so we're going to switch into game mode. We don't really need all this. Here, you can take this. I don't need it. I don't need this. And so, um, game mode myself. Game mode zero, and we're good. We're going to read this. Help, help. The only, not only has the evil Ignit put these mob spawners here so his creatures will attack us at night, but he's also stolen our sapling of life, which I have. Without the sapling, without the sapling, our tree will die. Can you, ha can you first break the mob spawners and then look for our sapling? There should be 15 spawners. We think the sapling is in the pyramid. I'm not sure if I spelled sapling right, but I don't care. I'm not going to even care to look. I think I did, though. And I've got a ton of gold. Okay, so we're going to go to set time set 18 slash time set 18,000. And that was nighttime. Okay, so we need to break all the mob spawners back. Back, I say, knaves. 
Oh, shoot. Actually, killed one of your villagers. Sorry. Break the mobs, Barnes. Ah, oh, God. Because that's two of fifteen. You don't get off my back. Have Gannett to the face. Are you kidding me? Wait, I'm right spawn on. Get out of here. How many times do I have to break you? The zombie spawner. Okay, so we just got the spawners on this side. There we go. That's another spawner. And a spider spawner. And a spider spawner. We're gonna get that zombie later. But now we have a witch spawner that we do not need to spawn a witch. Oh look. We got tons of items here. That uh, uh, help me add to my collection for getting that. Sorry, piggy. All right, you can play that game. Dummy. Oh yeah, I have a thorn three enchantment. It's cool. Every time they hit me, they get hurt themselves. Pretty cool. I'm just gonna dig out of here because I don't have time to get stuck. Okay, that spawner. Okay, so I think the worst of it is over. Ah, uh, here we go. Ah, oh, shoot. Oh, shoot, I just dropped my Gannett chip. Oh, look, this didn't bounce off the wall. Okay, good. Okay, so I think that's most of the spawners. I do not even know how much we bro um, this broke. I don't see any more spawners. And I think there's supposed to be an equal number on each side. And ouch, I'm gonna die of cactus. I think that is all the spawners. Wait. There is one over there. Aha, uh -huh, another one over here. I wish I counted how many I just broke. Oh, shoot! Uh, game. Uh, I already died. Oh dear. We're just gonna fly back there because I don't have time. No other patience. Bonsai! Why are there so many chunk errors? Maybe it's because I'm up too high. I wish I could fly faster. Faster, faster. 
I think I've broken all the spawn. I think that is indeed all the spawners. Okay, so we just beat all the spawners. I'm gonna slash game mode myself again. Oh, shoot. There we go. And now that you have the sapling of life, we can already go up here and we can claim our prize. What the heck? Okay, I don't know what happened here. And now that we have this sapling of life, we can claim our prize of five emerald blocks. Yeah! Got are falling. This guy has resistance on, he's invincible. No matter what, I can't kill him. Okay, so now that we have the sapling of life. I mean, now that we've just given back the sapling of life, we're going to defeat Master Ignit. I know he's over in this direction. Ouch. Okay. And there's the building of Ignit. Let's see now. Uh, I don't have my other splash potion. It sucks. I could have swore I used it. I could have used it to poison my enemies. It can either be used on yourself to give you resistance to speed, but I wouldn't recommend that. Or it can be used on your enemies, which is my um, original use for it. Die again. Ah, oh, shoot. This is what I was afraid of. Ah, oh, shoot! Okay, that was not good. Um, I'm just gonna take one of these beds. Because I don't think I left a little bed there for me to sleep in. And so, as we go back, slash game mode, one, I'm also going to set time, set night, I'm going to sleep in my bed, because I do not want to have to go all the way back there. Okay, flash game mode one. Ah, uh, shoot. Flash game mode zero. Okay, there. Now we can continue. Where are you, Ignit? Ah, uh, shoot. Ah, oh, shoot. In case you haven't noticed yet, 
They also have the Scythe of Necromancy. So what I'm going to do is, I'm actually going to use my Bolt of the Common Hunter to kick his butt. Come on, Ignit, die. Got, like, punch on it. The heck? This armor have thorns on it too? I think it might have thorns on it. I think this armor also has projectile protection too. Dang it, his armor also has thorns on it, and I just killed him! I killed Ignit. Yes! Oh, shoot. Well, now that I've killed Ignit, I can place you get out of here. Oh, shoot. Uh, oh no. Seth and Necromancy. I think their armor also has thorns on it. Okay. So now that I have defeated Ignit, that is another boss. And we're going to call it episode, and I didn't even need this bed. Well, I didn't need this bed. And we're going to sleep, and we're going to call it episode. I say this is a pretty good episode. We defeated another boss, and, um... We defeated another boss, and we defeated the side quest, and we completed the side quest, and we got some more stuff. So in next episode, we're going to go into the nether dimension and defeat um, the nether boss. And then maybe in the episode after that, we're going to go into the end and defeat the evil Dr. Paradox. So anyway, guys, I'm Gamelin, or Game Master 13000 It looks like I'm holding a little book. And I'll see you guys later. If you want to see more of these videos, like and subscribe. Um, and become an addition to the Gamelin Guild. And um, if I get 20 subs, which I'm only one sub away, um, I will do a special video. So anyway, I'm Game Master 13000 and I'll see you later. Bye-bye.